I'm Grump. I'm not so Grump. And we're the Game Grumps. All right, hey, welcome back. Tell me something. Uh huh. What is that queue? And that giant airship. The queue is a is like a quest, I guess. Ooh. It's one of the stages. We've been going through all these different queues. Where you see my face. That's my beautiful ship face. Conquered. Yeah, that's what we already did. Nice. But I'm going to the Hall of Champions because, well. <laughs> well, that's where the hot peacock lady is. Oh. Hello. This is the Hall of Champions. I love a monkey bitch with the fat dudes at this good neck. Well, the female peacocks don't have the fan tail, do they? I think that's just her outfit. But you're right. Okay. They do not. And she, yeah, she might be o a goose. Only the males have that. To impress the females. Oh, yeah. Dude, that is why I got a full comic book tattooed all over my body. Just so I'm bright and colorful and I'll, I'll attract the ladies. And only the lady who becomes my girlfriend will get to read how it ends. <laughs> <laughs> it ends on a cliffhanger right when your pee pee is? Yeah. <laughs> oh, it must be killing you not to know. <laughs> Welp! <laughs> <laughs> Gotta go! Unless you want to take this to the next level. Because I can tell you what, Superman takes it to the next level. Wait a second. What? Wait a second. Yeah. Is this what you were telling me about? Yeah. The Hall of Champions? Yeah. Does that mean I'll be able to recognize one of these fine faces? No, I'm not in it. Oh, damn it. I didn't submit my oh, face. Oh, damn it. But they emailed me and said that they felt bad that I didn't, even though it wasn't their fault at all. Right. And they were gonna try to get me in. We feel bad that you fucked up. Yeah. <laughs> so, <laughs> oh, I mean, Yacht that, Club, that, you guys that, are great. Yeah, that goes, that goes to show you how fucking swell these guys are. Yeah. That they're like, oh man, like, we're gonna take responsibility for the fact that you're an asshole. Yeah. And, uh, do something nice for you, even though you're an asshole. <laughs> <laughs> Pretty sweet. So, that's- that. I love these guys. D does that mean, in a future version, your name might be in there? Yes, in an update, I your, think. Your I think, I think. They didn't promise me anything. Cool. They just said, there's maybe sort of kind of a chance that possibly you, uh, didn't fuck up. Cool. Maybe they'll put me in it, too. That'd be cool. I mean, yeah, I but didn't you... donate anything to yeah. the campaign. <laughs> but you know what? There's a dollar right there. It's got your name on Mailing it. Mailing it to you. I have I you know what is 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 funny is um you know when you kickstart it for for a certain amount, like a reasonable amount. I think right. the price of the game, you you get the game. Right. And so I got a copy of the game for for free because of that, or I guess I paid for it or whatever. Right. But I got a copy of the game because of that. And also, they sent me uh, a review copy of the game because, you know... Is there a difference? Well, no. They, okay. just, they, oh, they just sent me a code for, like, another copy, right? Got it, got it. Um, oh, this is what I have to do. Um, ah, smart. And then I went out and I bought every single fucking version. <laughs> just with my own money. I think, like, I got the the Wii U one, like, twice, too. Uh, I bought the 3DS one, I bought the Steam one. Is there a much different feel between them, or...? Oh, no, not at all. Cool. Just, they just... just be I, I just dude. wanted to buy them, because they deserve my support. Yay! So... Love it. There you go. Way to go. You guys should go out and buy Shovel Knight too. Ding! I am, I am not being endorsed by Shovel Knight, aside from them being cool dudes. Yep. That's an endorsement on and of itself. Yep. Because they're cool dudes, and if you're a cool dude, then we'll play your game on the yep. show. And when they create their next game, Shovel Dan, I will, <laughs> I will thank them as well. Right, guys? Okay. <laughs> That's the sequel. <laughs> okay. It's like... And when, and when they scrap their project Shovel Dan... <laughs> And, uh, decide that Shovel Aaron right. was a way better title. Right, right. Uh, then, well, yeah. the rest is history, honestly. <laughs> Perhaps Shovel Friends? No! <laughs> no Shovel Friends. Uh, I guess we can settle on Shovel Grumps. That'd be cool. Yeah, so when they scrap Shovel Dan and Shovel Aaron, yeah. uh, not because Shovel Aaron was a bad idea, just because... I don't know, it was financially more viable to make Shovel Grumps. It was a bad idea. Because... Yeah. And when they when they shorten it to... to Shumps. <laughs> for... to keep... because the kids on the street, you, you know, you gotta keep things hip. Yeah, Shumps. Them. Yeah, you, you gotta be able to um, type it in a text message in five characters or less. My favorite is like when managers and agents and stuff talk about how they understand, like, hipness. 
And I'm like, if you understood hipness, you'd also understand that hip is not a word that's used anymore. <laughs> So true, my friend. Yeah. So true. And how, as they would say. Where are we going? I'm... Ch um, I, I don't, there's supposed to be a ghost for me to kill. Uh, I ran out of ghosts. Oh, there he oh, is. Ah, okay. There he goes. Oh, he's dead now. You have to find them all. Yeah, you gotta kill all the ghosts and then it reveals all the peeps. Uh... I love this fucking guy up here. Ha! Hi! <laughs> Kind of, kind of looks like Chad. It does kind of look like Chad. Chad Quant. Hey, represent Chad Quant. Pew, pew, oh, pew, 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 pew. this does not look promising. Yeah, all the ghosts come together to form Mega Ghost, and he can't see because his hat's too big. So. Oh, oh yeah, I, I didn't realize everything was a doofy smile. So I got to put it out of his misery now. Yeah, I love it because <laughs> not being able to see—that's the worst thing. Am I right, that's, guys? Yeah. Am I right? You shouldn't have to live like that. Yeah, honestly, that's the worst. Whoa. Sorry to all our blind fans. <laughs> Do you think we have blind fans? Uh, I think there's potential, but I don't know. Yeah, I guess with any, like... Because we just talk. Yeah, yeah. I, I suppose they're like, oh, I hate it when they talk about the game. <laughs> <laughs> God, show me, don't tell me, Grumps. Oh, God, just tell another fucking story about your dad, Dan. Jesus Christ, I'm <laughs> sick of this video game bullshit. It's fucking spoofy. <laughs> <laughs> Ah, that was spoofy. that was one of my favorites this, in a while. This boss is so fucking easy. Is he easy? Yeah. Looks like there's a lot going on, but yeah, maybe. but I got it. Yeah. I got it under control, bro. Got it under control. You just gotta hit the orbs and bounce them up in the air and hit them with the orb shit that comes out. With the it's orb a, shit. It's an ingenious idea. Orb shit, bro. It feels like they really did everything. Like, I'm sure you could do other stuff, but like, man, if they ever did a shovel knight deuce, right. I, you don't know how they'd improve on it? Yeah, I don't know. Just more more enemies, I guess. Yeah, I guess. More, uh... More knights. More shovels. Another racial slur from a foreign country that doesn't translate. Like, uh... Oh, like Tinkerman. Yeah. Tinkerman? Yeah. <laughs> what is this, Mega Man? This is my favorite line. Then again, that's the risk you run, paying for something in advance before you know the details. Oh, shit. <laughs> nice, <laughs> nice. <laughs> oh, boy. Anyway, on to our next battle against... Black person. <laughs> <laughs> red skin. <laughs> oh, red skin. That is... that is funny. That's what they called them, right? What do you mean? I was watching an old episode of Beanie and Cecil. What is Beanie and Cecil? Oh my! You've never seen Beanie and Cecil? No. The fuck is wrong with you, man? I guess a lot of. I'm things. sorry. I would never do that. I'm not the kind of guy that <laughs> judges people for not seeing stuff. But what the fuck, <laughs> man? What is it? Beanie and Cecil is an old. Well, it started as like an old uh, puppet program. Right. I think that it was attached to another program. I don't remember the name of it, but um, uh, it was a. Uh, it was Beanie, who was like a kid with a wearing a beanie. Right. And then uh, Cecil, the C6 Sea Serpent. Aww. Um, and, and he talked like this! <laughs> oh, Beanie Boy! And he, he's the best, and he's hilarious, and mm. anything that he says is funny. Um, it's Except one, Redskin? It, well, it's, it's one of those classic cartoons where, like, the characters are funny, right? Right. Like, the situations they're put in are, like, really, like, children-y. Right. But... When you just watch it, it's fucking hilarious and makes you laugh nonstop because of how stupid they are. Right. Um, right. But anyway, uh, what was I saying? Oh yeah, <laughs> I don't know why I had to explain this for this. There's just a scene where like there's a there's a there's a Native American like running away and he's like, <laughs> oh I have to set up the joke. Okay. Okay. <laughs> there's a Native American running away and then there's the character that they're fighting and he's and he's a coward. Okay. So, Beanie goes. There goes the red skin, and <laughs> it's a Native American. And then there's the villain that runs by, and he goes, There goes the yellow skin! <laughs> oh, man. Uh, I don't know. 30s humor. Yeah. I love it. Well, yeah, because there's a big controversy now. Um, because of the, uh, the Washington, D.C. football team called the Redskins. Oh, shit. Yeah. Which is very interesting, because they are the main, well, one of the main enemies of the Giants. So, like, I've watched that team forever. Um... And never even thought twice about it. Because their symbol is like... You know, the Cleveland Indians have that, um... Have you ever seen him? Chief Wahoo, they call oh, him. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, he's like... <laughs> it's like a cartoon Indian face. And, I was still, like, and it's called the Indians. Yeah, yeah. I was like, you know what? I, I, I guess I can understand people getting upset about this. But the, the Redskin symbol is like kind of like a noble-looking... Like, sort of like... 
the Indians like on the buffalo nickel, you know? Oh, like, yeah. So, um... You mean the Native Americans? That's the one. So, <laughs> sorry, sorry. I just can't get it out of my head. But, like, so... I remember hearing, like, a little bit about it when I was a kid. Like, this is kind of fucked up. And, uh... And my friend's dad was like, Yeah, whatever. You know what? If they if they change the Giants' name to the New York Pollocks, I wouldn't even care. <laughs> 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 like, you're kind of hilarious. <laughs> I wouldn't even care. Yeah, it was great. But yeah, so, but I guess like now we're in more like politically correct times. So there's a big like, um, to do about it. And they might have to change the name eventually. They will. I... One day. I think they will too. I mean like, they certainly don't mean it in an offensive way. Yeah, like, so, sure. Like the, the, the team... It, it was it was named to like honor like uh, Native Americans, but like I don't know. I don't even know. It, I feel like I'm just so like out of the loop on a lot of this shit. Like the uh, um, a Native American tribe came out and they were like, "Redskin is a slur," and I'm like, "It is." Like I didn't even know it was. Yeah, yeah. I, but I mean, I guess they'd know better than I would. That's true. Um, yeah, because they're the ones who have the fucking weird rednecks spitting shit at them all day. Right, I, yeah. Get out of my land! Yeah, Even did. though that's racist. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. It, it's, it's just a strange thing, so I don't... Like, like, like all social issues, I'm like, ah, I see both sides, and uh, I'll never be able to make a decision, so... You guys just yell at each other for a while, and I'll... Yeah. <laughs> I'll sit here and play video yeah, games I'll watch all football. Oh, wait, before we sign off, uh -huh. I just want to say I did find... Uh, the picture. Remember, I said, uh, I was talking about that, uh, picture of me in the Giants hat that my dad risked his life to, like, uh -huh. get. Um, I found, I found the picture. Like, Barry put up a joke picture because I couldn't find the real one. But, uh. But you actually finally found it? Yeah, I found, well, I found a picture of me wearing it. Here, check this out. Damn! <laughs> oh, shit! My pussy just got soaked! All right, you know what? Next time on Game Rooms, <laughs> just trying to fucking share a little moment from my childhood. I'm sorry. Got to bring fucking. I'm sorry. No, it's I'm okay. I'm sorry. I have to make a joke out of everything. Nope. Nope. It's cool. It's cool. Especially your doofy ears. <laughs> <laughs> I love you, butt, Dan. Thank you. <laughs> that was such a cute, sincere thank you. No, I mean, I, I appreciate it.